My name's uh, Stephen Hummel. Uh, I own Archive of the Afterlife, the National Museum of the Paranormal. Experiences here at the at the Archive have ranged from people just not feeling comfortable being in certain areas or rooms. There's that feeling that something's like been around corners tonight. People being physically uh, touched and or physically harmed. We witnessed firsthand that there were multiple scratch marks on her on her daughter's back. Let me. Whoa. Mm -hmm. That was definitely in that room. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Items range anywhere from uh, burial mass to haunted Dr. Seuss foot book that was reportedly from the scene of a quadruple homicide. The one closest to me will actually light up. What is your name? What? Certain items that came from exorcisms, demonic cases, there are certain en entities and attached items that I have in the dark room that are not to be taken lightly. Oh. What was your ear? Oh, that's crazy. No. That's the first time I've ever heard that. The Hope doll is, in my opinion, way worse than the Betsy Bell doll. She's caused physical harm, spiritual harm. Hope, do you like being kept in the cabinet? No. What? My friends from PQ and I were all investigating uh, in the dark room. One, the doll actually moved by itself. Something just breathed at me. And then right then and there, reported uh, having a burning sensation on his hand, and he had scratch marks on his hand. I'm getting ready to go do my solo with, with hope. Why are people so afraid of you? Yeah.